Hey guys, George of Soundtracks here, and this week we're going to talk about volumes, how to set them, and what they can do for you. So let's get started. Now when it comes to our Tsunami 2 and Ekonami decoders, every single sound effect that is in each of those decoders has its own CV to adjust the volume. Things like horn, bell, prime mover, things like that are kind of obvious and those are stored in the CVs as you know. But every sound effect on our decoder has its own volume control including things like the steam generator, the brake squeal effect, or the poppet valve and other things like that all have their own volume control. Now each of these CVs is adjustable 0 to 255 equals 0 to 100 percent volume. And you can adjust these CVs with any DCC system or if you prefer you can use things like decoder Pro. Now just keep in mind Dakota Pro is not a substitute for the manual. It does do well in many things, but if you want to understand how the feature works, be sure to check out our user's guide. Now each of these volumes are set in CVs 129 through 160, and every single sound effect has its own assigned to CV. Now for example here, we're going to take our prime mover sound that's just sitting here idling, and that's going to be CV 131. Now I can take this and I can adjust this down to a value of 10 where you hear that prime mover drop down to just about off but you can still hear it very slightly. Now if I take CV131 again and I'm going to set it to max of 255 you can hear how much louder it is now. So we're going to take CV131 we're going to set it down around 100 which is a very realistic tone in comparison with all the other sounds. Now last once you adjust the individual volumes for every sound effect, you do have a master volume control set in CV128. Again, it works the exact same way, 0 to 255 equals 0 to 100 percent. So if you want to reduce the overall volume first and then adjust the individual volumes to match, then, then you have the ability to do that with our products. Now with other products, they'll have things like bell, horn, prime mover, background sounds. And that doesn't give you the flexibility that you need to adjust your models. Now for more information please visit our website at Soundtracks.com. Be sure to check out, as I mentioned, the Steam and Diesel User's Guide as well as the Electric User's Guide and it will give you the full rundown of the CVs and what CV numbers correspond to which sound effects so you can adjust the volume levels for you.